Alcudas Boys High School was one of the best college prep schools in Baghdad, but fighting between insurgents and coalition forces left it in tatters. With guidance of nearly $570,000 from the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers, a team of Iraqis completed renovations earlier this year. Kevin Casey reports from Baghdad. Al-Qudas Boys High School has taken a beating in this war. It serves 500 students in the Mansur neighborhood of central Baghdad. Before the war, that was a very upscale neighborhood, is my understanding. And uh, that school had a very good reputation. It was a, uh, one of the better known boys' schools, high schools in Baghdad. And, uh, of course, during the war, during the fighting, it was occupied, I think, at various times by American forces and insurgents and suffered a lot of damage. The windows were shattered and the doors were blown off. Even the blackboards came off the walls. After the rehabilitation, the school has become beautiful. Even the students have more desire to study and attend. The renovation cost $570,000 and finished in January, one month ahead of schedule. Uh, the project was conceived through the uh, PRDC, the Provincial Reconstruction Development Committee. So it was basically Iraqi concept. Uh, Iraqis did the design, Iraqis supervised the construction. And uh, other than the overall project oversight, you know, here from the Corps of Engineers and the funding, it was, uh, it was mostly an Iraqi project. And I think that's the way we need to be going more and more. Witnessing the project has inspired 17-year-old junior Mahmoud Kassar. He hopes his grades will earn him a spot in engineering college. If I become an engineer, I will help to rebuild Iraq. I will repair the buildings the insurgents have damaged. With God's help, they will be good as new. For the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers, I'm Kevin Casey.